exactly is a veterinarian's job? Well, a veterinarian has to take care of animals. That's the first and foremost. Then they must examine animals and diagnose health problems. They perform surgeries and clean and dress animals' wounds and injuries. They test for diseases and infections, give vaccinations to prevent diseases and other medical conditions. They use medical equipment like an x-ray machine to examine and diagnose their health problems. Veterinarians prescribe medications to animals to help them get better. Veterinarians on a routine visit advise pet owners on the general care and treatment of their animal. Most traditional veterinarians have to work in indoor clinics where pet owners bring in their animals to be examined. If a vet decides to treat a larger animal, they often have to travel to the owner's home. It may mean traveling to farms, working outdoors, or analyzing results in a laboratory while on call. In an emergency situation, they may have to perform surgeries outside in severe weather conditions, and these can often be unsanitary, and they must use extra caution. The indoor clinic needs to be made as comfortable as possible, as it is often very noisy and can be stressful for the animals and people working. Because of animal emergencies, vets often have to work long hours, nights, and weekends. They work more than their scheduled hours, sometimes exceeding 50 hours a week. To have this job, veterinarians must be very patient. Dealing with animals can be very difficult, and they need to be able to make good, quick decisions under extreme pressure. The starting salary for this career would be around $43,400. The salary would eventually be worked up to about $82,000. This was the average salary for all veterinarians as of May in 2010. To become a veterinarian, you must have a Doctor of Veterinary Medicine degree, or a DVM. You would need a state license to be hired in an established clinic, or you could form one yourself if you had the proper licensing. To exceed in this career, you would have to be good at biology, so you could know how animals' bodies function and work, health, to understand why diseases, viruses, and injuries occur, and how they would affect the animal, math, you would use to be able to make calculations and use medical tools in the workplace and when traveling. Becker College has all the necessary degrees that you would need to become a veterinarian. The cost of tuition is $30,340 a year. Cost of books, $1,100 a year. Cost of room and board, $11,050 a year. Cost of transportation, $1,200 a year. Cost of personal, $1,500 a year. And for a grand total of $45,190 to attend Becker College. This career is a growing one. It is expected to increase in size by over 36% in the next 20 years. The career is growing and the need for veterinarians is increasing. There's always an option to open your own clinic if you cannot find a current job opening in any established clinic. This job could be very rewarding because you would have the feeling of helping pets and their owners. The career's eventual salary would more than enough pay for the education needed to get a job in this field. Some disadvantages of having this job is that the animals could be nervous or in pain and there's always the risk that vets could get bitten, scratched, or otherwise hurt by the injured animals. Extra schooling is of course required to have this job and you would need to work unexpectedly if there's ever an emergency and your schedule hours wouldn't always be during these emergencies, causing you to work overtime very often. A few careers related to being a veterinarian is to be a veterinary assistant, an animal care and service worker, or a zoologist. Some possible places of employment are a veterinary clinic that you could open yourself or get employed to, a zoo, or a rescue animal shelter. This is all the basic information you need to know to become a veterinarian.